Hey, this is Brett and this 2023 Jeep Grand Cherokee Limited with the black appearance group is stock number 23J7. I am here at Summit Automotive in Fond du Lac, Wisconsin, your new and used Jeep and Jeep Grand Cherokee headquarters. This is our very first 2023 Jeep Grand Cherokee L that we've gotten on our lot. Really a nice package on this one. I'm gonna go all the way around in this video, give you all the information that I can on this particular one. We're gonna check out the original window sticker, go inside under the hood, turn all the lights on at the end of the video, and that's coming pretty quick. So uh, stay tuned for that. First off, I'll say that this one has a 3.6 liter Pentastar V6 engine, puts out 293 horsepower and 260 foot-pounds of torque. This one is capable of towing up to 6,200 pounds and has a max payload of 1,410 pounds um, capability. It's gonna get you 25 miles per gallon on the highway, 18 city, for an average of 21 miles per gallon with the four-wheel drive system. Diamond black is the uh, color, and PXJ is the paint code on this one. This one also has a 23-gallon fuel tank. As we come around to the front here, the uh, redesign from two years ago, still looking really fresh and good. The seven-slotted grill, of course, for the seven continents that Jeep has driven on. The black appearance group appears to give you the blacked out Jeep lettering, the blacked out uh, bezels on there, and uh, the blacked out front fascia and bumper. Blacked out headlight bezels as well. This one does have LED headlamps, LED running lights, and LED fog lamps. And like I said, we're gonna turn all those on at the end of the video. Also gives you the 20 inch painted black alloy rims, and it has Pirelli Scorpion tires. These are the Scorpion Verdes. And the size on these is 265 50R20s. Kind of a highway tread pattern on there. Four wheel disc brakes, of course, on the uh, Grand Cherokees. And Diamond Black has just a little bit of metal flake to it. It's got a little bit of a gold flake, which I really like. Um, when it's out in the sunlight, it's really spectacular to uh, check out. You also get the Blacked Out Grand Cherokee and American Flag lettering on the side. We'll take a look at the original window sticker. Feel free to pause this. I'm not gonna go through everything, but um, most of it. Grand Cherokee L Limited. Diamond Black's the color, global black interior. Capri leather seats, 3.6 liter with the eight-speed automatic transmission. Everything on the left there is your standard equipment, including the uh, Quadra Track 1, Jeep Wave, Select Terrain, Remote Start, Power Lift Gate, Adaptive cruise control, active lane management, all that stuff is standard equipment. Interior features, those are all standard as well. And uh, then the optional equipment starts with the diamond black paint, which is 395. This one has a trailer tow prep group. So it's kind of an interesting thing because it doesn't actually have the receiver hitch or wiring, but it has the prep group, which gives you the trailer hitch zoom, automatic headlamp leveling system, the rear load leveling suspension and the full size spare tire. So uh, it's all set up, all it needs is the receiver hitch and wiring installed and then it's all ready to tow up to 6,200 pounds. Black appearance package is 2,095 because you the 20 inch rims and the gloss black exterior accents. This one also has the rear entertainment group which is 1,995 because you the two, two point, or 10.1 inch rear entertainment screens, and Amazon Fire TV built in. Total MSRP on this Grand Cherokee L is 56,795, three year 36 bumper to bumper, five year 60 powertrain. And if you wanna get your summit price in the upper right hand part of the screen is a link to our website to get all the pricing and information on this particular Grand Cherokee. There's your miles per gallon, 18 city, 25 highway for an average of 21, and your average fuel cost is 2,100 bucks does not have any safety ratings yet, although I'm pretty sure the uh, Grand Cherokees are known for their safety ratings being very high. As we come around to the back, you get the LED tail lamps as well, the uh, rear bumper parking sensors, and you'll see that it does have the hitch cover uh, that does come off, but it's just a bar behind there, so it's all ready to have the receiver hitch installed. Um, this one also has the power lift gate, which comes standard on the limited package. Back storage area, get a nice amount of space back here. 
and I believe your jack tools are in there. So these seats do fold down for even more storage and then it's kind of like the uh, two row Grand Cherokee, which is nice. But you have the options for the option for the third row seating, which is a nice thing to have if you have to haul around extra people. Notice you get the blacked out 4x4 and L and Jeep and Limited badge on the back. This one has the capless fuel fill, which is a really nice feature to have. Never get gas. You notice you get the roof rack rails up there. They are gloss black as well. And all the door trims are gloss blacked as well. You do get blind spot monitoring, built in directional signals and heated mirrors. Inside the limited package gives you the black leather interior, the global black leather, capri leather seats, the titanium stitching on there, power driver seat with lumbar, factory floor mats, auto headlamps, nice wood grain trim, tilt, telescopic steering wheel, memory driver seat, um, power windows, power locks, power mirrors, Take a quick look at the back seats. So you get the second row quad seating in this one with the captain's chairs, nice armrests. There are the 10.1 inch screens with the Amazon Fire TV built into them. You get rear air controls, second row heated seats, 115 volt, 150 watt plug-in, two USBs and two USB-Cs. So these seats go down a couple different ways. The first way is just the backrest goes down. And then the other way is that the whole seat kind of goes up and forward like that for access to that third row. And then they even kind of fold up a little bit more, uh, which makes it pretty easy to get to that third row seat. That's just the two seater back there. And it goes down like that. And then these are adjustable as you can see. You get the nice wood grain trim on the back doors, child safety locks as well. We'll hop inside, check out the miles, the radio, well, instrument cluster radio. It's only got 38 miles on it. So, uh, you can see rear seat alert active. This one has the driver assist system. You have adaptive cruise controls on the steering wheel, uh, the lane departure, of course, uh, normal cruise controls. You get the heated leather wrap steering wheel, information center controls, Bluetooth controls, nice wood grain trim on there as well. And then you can select all your different options from the screen there. And uh, just a really nice system to have. And the steering wheel is trimmed out very nicely. I like the Jeep right in the middle there. This one comes with the touchscreen radio that I believe this is a Uconnect 5 radio. So you get the factory navigation system and uh, you have all your different media that you can do here. AM, FM, Sirius connected to your Bluetooth device. You have your radio controls here and your climate controls, including your heated seats and heated steering wheel controls there or up on the screen. Notice the dual climate controls. You have all your different apps here. If you go to all, you can see, you can pretty much get to everything in here. And it's all touch screen, it's all scroll. Um, so a lot of really nice stuff that you can do. I wonder if I can get to the backup camera. And I love these backup cameras. They are crystal clear uh, HD cameras and like it said, you can re zoom in on the receiver hitch once you get one installed. Uh, so that's really cool too. You can put those third row headrests down. I'll, sh I'll press the button and show you that happen. So that's pretty cool. Don't do it when anybody's sitting back there. They'll get mad at you. And then you have all your different other apps here, including the off-road pages, which I'll show you real quick. Um, you have your steering angle, whether the transfer case is locked or unlocked. You have your accessory gauges, your pitch and roll, and your select terrain, um, latitude, longitude, altitude, all that good stuff. So really cool stuff that you can do with this radio. So then the 
terrain settings, you have snow or sand, mud, snow, auto, and sport. And if you change that, it changes it up there. That's snow, sand, and mud. And then auto just kind of configures to whatever terrain you're on. And then you have sport mode with the uh, Jeep drag strip there. So pretty cool stuff. Eight-speed automatic transmission. Everything's all trimmed out in the gloss black. USBs, two USB-Cs, and AUX jack. This is gloss black as well. Up here you have your start, stop, your lane departure, stability control, your parking sensors. Love the wood grain trim in the Grand Cherokee. Really good looking. And then up here you get SOS and assist buttons, map lights, and home link buttons for your garage door security systems and lighting systems. There is the LED lights there. And uh, like I said, we'll start it up, take a look at all those lights in the front. And uh, yeah, we'll go from there. Show you the back lights as well. We'll take a look under the hood. Grand Cherokees look pretty sharp from the back. I would personally like to thank you for checking out the video today and hopefully from this HD video you've been able to verify the uh, looks, styling, and options on this particular Grand Cherokee. Hope you enjoyed it. There are those LED lights, both the fogs, the running lights, and the headlights are ultra bright. And under the hood here, here are the 3.6 liter V6 dual overhead cam. Pentastar engine, 293 horsepower, 260 foot-pounds of torque. Uh, remember, it's going to get you 25 highway, 18 city, 21 average with the four-wheel drive. has a max tow of 6,200 pounds and a max payload of 1,410 pounds and a 23-gallon fuel tank as well. There is the mission sticker. And uh, that's pretty much it. Thanks for checking out the video. Remember to comment on it, like, subscribe, share. Let me know what you think of the 2023 Grand Cherokee L Limited, especially with the Black Appearance Group. I think the Black Appearance Group looks great. And to see more pictures of this Jeep or one of our other 550 new and used cars, trucks, SUVs, minivans, Wranglers, Cherokees, Grand Cherokees, Grand Cherokee Ls, you name it, we got it. Go to that website right there, summitauto.com. Full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle from two locations, all at summitauto.com. And if you'd like to check out more HD videos, you can go to youtube.com slash summitauto. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on this video and all the videos that you see there. Click the bell notifications and you'll get updates on the videos I do each and every day here at Summit Auto. In fact, in a second, you will see a link to subscribe to my YouTube channel in the upper left, a link to more Grand Cherokee videos like this one in the upper right, a link to this vehicle on our website in the lower left, and a link to one of our latest YouTube videos in the lower right. Click those, check us out, and we're super excited to be offering the brand new 2023 Jeep Grand Cherokee L Limited with the black appearance group in diamond black metallic. Thanks again for checking out the video. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on the YouTube channel. I really appreciate it. Thanks again.